Hi guys, welcome back. So, uh, tonight we're going to do a geode tour. Uh, if you don't know what that is, it's like, it's alternating between pouring rings onto a canvas and then pouring, doing like a cup pour and I'm going to layer the cup and then adding in, I put some gems in here. Adding in crystals afterwards. Uh, I don't have a whole lot of them, so we're probably just going to do them around the corners or try, depending on how it turns out. We'll do the areas where it needs it. Uh, I have tinted those brown, so I'm letting the paper towel on there to get the moisture out while we do this. There's not a whole lot because I use alcohol ink. So my colors, I'm doing browns and gold. Uh, the first color I've got is burnt umber. It is a ready to pour paint. Uh, the second color I got is raw sienna, but I did add a little bit of it into a cup here because I added a little bit of dragonfly glaze to it. I wanted it to be sparkly, this one. Um, my second color, my next color is black. Got some black here that we're going to pour in between the layers. I have a blush. I don't have a whole lot of it because I don't really want a whole lot of it in it. I just want to add a little touch of it because of all of these dark colors. And then I have metallic gold. Uh, the metallic gold, all of these colors here, <coughs> excuse me, except the two ready to pour, and my um, other color, my base color, is mixed with American Flow Draw. That's it. American Flow Draw. Uh, if they're too thick, I will add just a squirt of water to them. The two ready-to-pour paints are just that. They're ready to pour, except this one here that I did add, the Dragonfly Glaze. I love this Dragonfly Glaze. It's so sparkly, and it makes everything look, makes a, metallic, a regular paint look like a metallic paint. Almost. It's just that sparkly. So, what we're going to start out doing, I'm going to pour a big puddle of white here in the center. We're going to kind of pick where the center is here. Alright. Now, we're going to start out by alternating colors. And I'm going to start with the raw sienna. I'm going to do a little bit of that. And then, uh, I think we might do a little bit of this blush okay. uh, maybe a little bit of the no, what do I want to do? a little bit of the gold okay uh, shot of the black bit of the burnt umber. Push these colors out. Alright. Now we're going to take our cup and we're going to layer colors. So since my color here is brown and that was the last color to come out. The last color I put on I want it to be my last color out of my cup. Preferably. Uh I'm going to throw just a shot of white in here. Okay, and then we're going to do some here. That's the raw sienna with the dragonfly glaze. Uh, let's do some gold on top of that. I'm going to do a little bit of this other color here. Ok. 
okay, and then a little bit of black. And maybe another shot of white on top. All right. Now, we pour this into the center of this. And we're going to do a ring pour. everyone's having a good night tonight if you're joining me on my channel thank you appreciate you watching all right I'm not too concerned with how that center there looks because we're gonna we're tilt it up and out anyway my canvas is really, really unlevel here. Why is my table so unlevel right there? Because it's flowing way over here. Let me get a couple popsicle sticks to stick under here. Just temporarily, anyway. We're going to be tilting it anyway, but I don't want it to tilt all the way off the edge here. There we go. Okay, now... We're going to go back in the center. This time I'm going to go in with just a plain raw sienna. Oops, in the circle there. Okay. I'm going to add some white to it. And we're going to add some gold. Add the burnt umber. We're going to add some metallic raw sienna. And some black. Need to tilt this back. It's coming way too far over. Bring it back into the center a little bit. Now this is looking pretty though, guys. I like the way this patterns are turning out. My little rings here. Very nice. Okay, so now we gotta layer another cup. It's got a little bit of brown in it still. I'm going to add, because this color at the end is going to come out, I'm going to add the raw sienna with the dragonfly glaze. I'm going to add some white. I'm going to add gold. I'm going to add the blush. black uh, what did I do I did the, did the burnt umber and a little bit more white and then we're going to pour it Let's see what kind of lines we get this time I'm working on a 12 by 12 canvas want it to go back this way come on there we go all right my white's going to be the first thing to come out
the colors of the print are going to be really pretty. I want it to look like natural stone. Back this way now. All right, let's get right back here where we want it. It's gonna drive me crazy to see him. Off center here. All right. Now I want to go back in, and we're going to do individuals again. So this time there's a lot of the, a lot of the brown there showing at the end. So we're going to put some white in the center, and then I think we're going to do gold. Everybody ready for New Year's? I have to work New Year's Eve. Uh, this is going to be fun. The day I don't mind so much. The night, work at a convenience store. So I imagine we're going to sell like a bajillion tons of beer. Uh, I mean, like a ton of beer. We already sell quite a bit anyway, but I bet we're really going to sell it that night. Everybody's going to be getting their party on we are be safe don't drive get a designated driver call an uber not worth it <coughs> you don't know how many people i see come to my store <coughs> that should not be driving and it's like there's really you know it's not i'm not to judge them but you know you can tell when somebody's pretty inebriated and if they're too bad, I won't even sell them alcohol. I'm like, no, I'm not selling it. You're too, you're drunk, you know. They get really upset, but it's like, and I get that's what you want to do, but you do not need to be out running around going to the store buying it. You don't need to be putting other people's lives at risk because you want to, you want to party for a night, you know. So, I have turned people down. Kid you not, turned them down on buying buying liquor or buying beer so <coughs> oh excuse me guys all right one more time we're going to do the little bring thing in the center but this one is just going to be a smaller one i'm going to start again with the white still a little bit in the bottom of the cup but that's kind of a mixture of all of them we're going to do the sparkly one Uh, let's do gold. Let's do some black. And I think that may be what we end up... No, I want to finish with the dark brown here. I think. Yeah, okay. Now, we're going to do this one again. Green floor. this little center here. We're going to take us a There we go. Alright, I'm going to move this paint stuff out of the way. I don't get the excess paint all over them. Alright, 
I think we already moved out of the way enough. We can tilt. And guys, I don't waste this paint. Whatever I tilt off of here will either be dried into skins or it will be uh, scraped up and used for another painting look. So we're going to center this first. too much here. I'm going to get it kind of centered. Alright. Now I want to take so I don't lose a lot of this on the edge here. I'll go around the edge. Got a lot of paint on here though so it won't hurt to lose some of it. Alright. So now here goes. Alright guys, what are we thinking? I'm really, 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 really liking this so far. Not a huge fan of this. Big fan of this pink there. Alright. Trying to decide. I really like it. Um, I think I'm gonna put my gems right here because that I'm not a fan of that part real big. I'm kind of thinking maybe along there and then where else? A few in the center. I want some more, maybe right in here, because I'm not a huge fan of this little piece right there. It doesn't look real. But I like this. I think this all looks like some natural stone. This is really pretty, guys. Wow, I love these colors. I love earth tone colors, though. Like this. I was like, this is such a pretty color. Such a pretty, pretty color. Alright. I'm going to torch this right quick. Just to, I don't... Not really looking for sales, not really trying to get sales. If it happens, it happens. But I want to pop bubbles like the FU. Because I did just mix this paint. Alright. Here goes with my little gems. I tried to dye some bigger stuff, but it didn't turn out. So we're just going to do the little ones. I might throw one of these bigger ones in with it. But yeah, we're just going to try the smaller ones here. Just going to try the little ones. Them turned out pretty good too, considering I didn't really dye them knowing what color they were going to turn out. Because I don't have a brown alcohol ink, so I had to mix my colors to make brown. I gotta get me some more of this stuff. This is handy. This glass is. 
I've heard you can take the Dollar Tree gems. Somebody, if you know in the comments, let me know. I've heard you can take the Dollar Tree gems and you can heat them up, like boil them or whatever, and then dump them into a bowl of ice water and it makes them crack. And then you can take a hammer and break them up into pieces like this. So if anybody knows if this really works, or if it's a different kind of gems, and I'm just thinking it's Dollar Tree ones. I thought I saw where it was like the Dollar Tree glass. I don't know if they're glass or not, but the little gems at Dollar Tree anyway. Because I would love to know because I would play with this stuff a lot more, but I just, I don't have money right now to invest in it. And, because I am in need of resin again. Actually, I'm about, well, I'm not out, but I'm about out. And I've got two orders coming from Timu for resin. Uh, guys, I reached my 50 subscribers. We actually hit 52. Super excited about that. Uh, if you have not saw it, I put a post in the community tab. Uh, telling about the different items that we were going to, that you have as an option of the prize that we're going to give away. Because I told everybody we'd give away a prize when I got to 50 subscribers. Big thing. I didn't, didn't think I would ever get even that far. So someday we're going to be doing this at 100,000 and hopefully a million. Uh, but uh, the item that was picked was a red, uh, acrylic core. If you want to be entered. Comment in the description box. Yes, please. And I will send you a number. That will be your number. And this time next week, today is Wednesday. Uh, the Wednesday before night. What is the date? I don't even know the date. 28th. 28th, 29th, 28th, I believe. 29th, maybe. Whatever. Wednesday. Next Wednesday will be the drawing and uh, the winner will get to choose what they want when they win what color they want it if they want a geode for if they want a bloom if they want just whatever they want and the colors they want it to be and we will do it on camera and I will video it and then it will be sent to the winner if you win and you want to, you're fine with me saying your first name on camera, then let me know and we'll talk about that. You know, if you don't, I won't say your name. I'll just say the winner is getting this. And this is their painting. Alright, I don't want to add any more and I don't have any more really to add, so I think we're good there. Guys, I really, really like this. This looks like stone in here. It really does. The colors. Wow. And so much sparkle because I added that dragonfly glaze to the raw sienna and made it so sparkly. And then I had the gold in there already. So it's extra sparkly. Well, guys, let me bring you down for a close up. I want to make this video too long. Alright, sorry for the spin around. Alright, we're going to go down here. We're going to get really close. My phone's messing with the colors. There we go, that's better. Look at this, it looks like stone right in there. And right through here. Isn't that beautiful? Alright guys, I will post the grad results on my next video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. It would really help my channel. Everybody watching? Thanks for watching. Bye.